Hello everybody. This video will deal how to get on repeaters. And uh, typically we get on repeaters with handhelds, but we could get on with fixed base stations. But today uh, I'm going to use uh, as a picture uh, this radio here. So the first thing we got to do is we got to get it on the right channel. So uh, we want to this radio. <clears throat> For this demonstration, this channel will be marked LFT-82, which means we're getting on the Lafayette repeater on a frequency of 146, 8.2 mega, uh, megahertz. All right, so the first thing we do is we turn the radio on, and uh, which, uh, which I will do. And I'm going to... And... Uh, we now need to get uh, we need to get the radio on the right side. So uh, right here on my radio, it's going to read. Oops, it's going to read 146.82, and uh, <clears throat> I'm going to press the button when I want to speak. And uh, if the channel is clear, uh, what you uh, what you do is you give your call. In my case, it's K5QXJ, and then you say monitoring, and you release the button. So uh, let me demonstrate that, and uh, if we're lucky, we'll hear the, uh, the repeater identify itself. So let me uh, let's try that. This is K5QXJ monitoring. Now you will hear this identifier only if the repeater's been idle for several seconds. But once you once you push the button and speak into it, you will hear a squelch tail come back and usually a courtesy tone. So let me just sort of demonstrate that. Is that this time I'm just going to push the button and release it. And you uh, hear the repeater come back and then followed by a courtesy tone. Now, if uh, somebody wants to speak to you, they will come back and give uh, their call and uh, give you a greeting. Now, <clears throat> we encourage all you young hams to get on. It's a little unfortunate that most of us are old fogies, but we're very interested in hearing uh, our new hams, so don't be intimidated. Uh, we, we encourage you to uh, come in and talk. And, uh, and if I'm on the air, I will certainly acknowledge you. And most of the guys in the area will do that. So we really encourage you to get on. Now, two of, uh, two of our young hams, Kendra and uh, Abby Wilson, have, uh, will head up a kid's net. And you'll be getting an email to, uh, to inviting you to join and you guys will pick a time where all you kids can get on and talk to each other. We also have other activities. One of the activities is a net that goes on uh, every Monday at 7 o'clock where all the hams in the area check in. We encourage you to listen and check in and make comments. Now uh, sometimes when you turn your radio on a conversation will already be in progress. And the way that you join that conversation is, is when, uh, when one ham quits talking, the and he releases the push to talk button. Uh, you will hear a courtesy tone, and uh, if you listen really close, you will hear this tone. A little bleep is the indication for you to come in, and you just give your call sign. For example, I would say. K5QXJ. Typically, the guys in conversation or ladies in conversation will hear you and they will acknowledge you and invite you to join their conversation. And again, we really encourage you guys to join in. And uh, and us old guys really want to really want to hear what you young hams are up to. 
So uh, we encourage you to uh, use your radio and get on and join uh, Abby and Kendra in the Kids Net. See you uh, so long till the next video.